I have no friends. And I don't necessarily think this is a bad thing. Um, I get to focus on uh, a lot of things that I probably wouldn't be able to focus on if I had friends. If I had friends, it would probably be be because I'm trying to fit in um, and do things I shouldn't be doing, like let's say drinking or whatever. Uh, I, I don't drink, I don't smoke, I go to the gym and I'm active and a lot of people don't, um, you know, they don't do the things I do. Uh, so I don't uh, connect with people in a way that uh, I would be like, be, that I would be able to make a good friend by. Um, and that's not to say I don't have like people I hang out with, we can call them friends, uh, but I don't have friends like this. I don't have any good friends just because, uh, you know, I, me and my friends from high school went different ways. Uh, I felt used by a lot of people. I felt let down by a lot of people and I don't have to deal with that um that could come with maturity or whatever um but I just kind of got tired of it and I just kind of cut people off um just because uh, I was being let down by people um in my inner circle and I just got tired of hanging out with them because I didn't feel like they uh valued my friendship and I just kind of stick to myself, like going to the gym, I even lift by myself, like, um, and that's not to say that one day I wouldn't want to lift with somebody, like that would be cool, whether it's a guy or a girl, but a lot of it, if I think about it, like I get to do what I want to do, like, um, like lifting wise, I'm on a, a good regimen, like, um, and I would have to change my regimen because I'm hanging out with somebody at the gym, which isn't a bad thing. Like I'm willing to compromise that, but it's like, I just like doing stuff that I want to do and I didn't get to do that. I just kind of went with whatever everybody else wanted to do and not value what I initially want to do and I don't sit and stay at home all the time. I'm really like going places. I talk to people. Um, I go to my adult group and it has a lot of different events going on. And uh, I talk with people and stuff, but sometimes like, I don't wanna feel like the conversation is pointless. Like it's not going anywhere. Um, like this is, uh, this is the, the highest our friendship is gonna go, like, if I feel like that, like, a lot of times, I don't feel like I even want to go anywhere, like, it's, it's constantly the same thing, I see the same people, and it's nothing against them, it's more of a personal thing, like, I need, like, something to actually get me to want to go, like, um, to things that are beside like uh, going and getting closer to God. Like I'm talking about the extra events that we go to and I do go to that. And a lot of times I'm glad I go, but sometimes I would just rather stay at home, hang out with my parents and my dogs and eat some pizza. Like for instance, like New Year's, I was supposed to go um, and hang out with people at the church. There was a New Year's Eve party at nine o'clock and nine o'clock gave me enough time to change my mind. Uh, it was, <laughs> you know, I'm, I, I'm older, I'm 28 now and I, I don't necessarily want to uh, go somewhere really late. And, and if I don't think it's like beneficial to anything that I, that I like that meets my needs or whatever, which is, I mean, 
it can be kind of selfish but i don't mean to be selfish everybody has needs everybody does things like um maybe for like fun or whatever like i'm talking about just like is it is it worth stay like should i stay at home eat pizza watch a movie or is it going to be better than that and sometimes uh, in my mind i i don't feel like it is um which is why i end up staying at home and it's nothing against them it's a personal preference uh it's it's just something i would rather do and i gen i mean i'm okay with where i'm at of course it would be great to have like those friendships that you do everything together you message people i don't really message anybody i just kind of stick to myself um and there's nothing wrong with that i'm just saying like i don't have like good friends like i don't really have friends and um you might be in a si sim similar situation where you actually strive to want friends um and it's not to say that that won't happen for me um because i'm open to it but i'm not like gonna force conversations i'm not gonna like overreach people just because um i don't want to feel let down because i feel like in today's society you like get let down a lot and i don't want to do that and sometimes i just want to stay by myself like i would rather just stay at home um not to say that i'm like an introvert because i personally believe that i'm like in the middle because i actually like uh doing stuff like i like going out and different things um but sometimes doing those things aren't better than staying at home and that's why i feel like i'm in the middle of an introvert and an extrovert and i feel like i'm a pretty good talker um and i don't know i just uh i I, I don't know if I'll ever get those connections with people just because I don't know I'm maybe I'm an in intimidating person as well like maybe I come off as intimidating which makes people not uh like not be sure to approach me just because they're intimidated by me or they don't want me in their group or whatever it may be um you know you're not gonna fit in in every group uh a lot of people want to go drink and smoke and do things that I don't want to do. Um, <laughs> drink coffee. I don't even drink coffee. So, I mean, we can get a hot chocolate or whatever. But I'm just in this point where I'm focused on myself. I get more things done. I don't have to, like, sacrifice what I'm doing for anybody else. And um, it's not to say that I'm like I would want to live my whole life that way it's just like right now I just don't really feel that um and even today like I have a thing going on which I don't even know if I'm gonna go to because I mean I do overthink it like sometimes um I'll just overthink how like things are gonna go and like if I feel like there's a point of disappointment that could possibly happen um that'll make me steer to like be like i don't want to waste my time um like am i like really like friends with these people um like do they do they even want me to like be there um like because maybe some people don't some i don't know that's an inner feeling of like some people don't want me to be in that group and that's kind of like maybe like a self thing um just because they're usually like interacting with like other people besides me like but that's not all the time that that might just be like every situation I've ever been in a, in my life like even when I had good friends that's just kind of how it went um but yeah I, I'm not really sure I just 
I'm at an age where I don't really care and um, I, I'm okay with like staying at home if that means um, you know I won't be disappointed in something and you might be in the same situation and you know friendships are overrated sometimes so yeah